Hey everybody, this is Buddy. Well, this is my second lap coming to Rogersville at the Hardy's. And I noticed something over the last few days I wanted to kind of mention. I noticed that my arms and my legs should be way darker than what they are based on the amount of riding I've done in the last three weeks. But um, I can take two days off and my tan fades really easy. So what I'm fixing to say is that the strength of the sun is not what it once was. The, even the color of the sun is not what it once was. Something is changing. Now I want you to think about it. I'm in Ozark, Missouri, longitude, latitude. It's almost impossible to keep a tan. Now, if I was in Houston, Texas, I'd like to see would the tan fade as quick. If anybody else out there has noticed that it's almost impossible to keep a tan, let me know. Because years ago when I was growing up and surveying in the 80s, I'd get so dark and it'd last all the way till Christmas. I'd still be dark at Christmas. And and that's, you know, with my shirt off and but just Give me your opinion. What do you think? Is it is it possible that the sun has changed? Something's going on. I think I know what it is. So stay tuned. I'll have more about the changing sun in our solar system. Let's start off with a question. What is Earth's axis? Think of it as an invisible line going from the North Pole to the South Pole, right through the middle of the Earth, and it's tilted at a 23 degree angle. Now that you know what the axis is, let's talk about how it got its tilt. When the Earth was very young, it was hit by a Mars-sized object. This collision created an explosion that was so powerful, it tilted the Earth. It was this same explosion that created the Moon. Also, if the axes wasn't tilted, we would only have one season, which would get really boring quickly. Well, that's how Earth got its tilted axes, and I hope you learned something.